Tonight, a resolution of sorts has been tentatively reached when it comes to tense contract negotiations between the Plant City Fire Union and the city itself. But as ABC Action News reporter Rochelle Aline explains, it's an agreement that's left people on both sides feeling like more work still needs to be done. 18 percent. According to the Plant City Fire Union, a recent study carried out by the city found that this is how much more firefighters in other cities of a similar size are being paid. This is what you're competing with. And after tense negotiations between the city and the union on the department's upcoming contract, the decision over firefighter pay was turned over to the city commission Monday night. What the union asked for, among other things, was a three-year contract with a bump in pay that would put salaries closer to that 18% mark. They also asked that the city relax the requirement that firefighters have to live in or around Plant City because they claim some can't afford to do so. Ultimately, they were offered a one-year contract with a 6% increase in pay and the option for a 4% merit-based pay increase on their work anniversary. The city says this increase falls in line with what they've offered other city employees. I think they're going to be disappointed. But the fire union's attorney isn't buying it. He tells ABC Action News that 18 people have left the department over the last five years, and he fears that trend will continue. There's been an exodus of qualified people because the city has decided that either it can't pay competitive wages to these highly trained individuals or they're not prepared to pay. The Plant City Mayor says the Commission's reasoning is closer to the latter. We understand that they, they, they want to see more. We want to do more. You know, I would love to just say absolutely, of course, we're going to give you everything that you want, but we can't do that. The Mayor says budget constraints are keeping them from higher increases, and he agrees that more work to improve pay needs to be done. That said, he also hopes that certain intangibles will help with retention. We have to be competitive, we understand that, but it's also about those cultural uh, things as well. You know, uh, the community that you want to work in, the people that you want to work in, the climate of the department. In Plant City, Rochelle Olim, ABC Action News.